All right, I'm back with another fan again. It's been a little bit. Well, actually, the last fan I did was uh, testing with Nolan Ferguson. And I'm excited with this one, testing it to finally get it running. And I like to say, on this week's edition of Brown Chunk, we have a Moss Tropical Breeze with a switch housing. And yes, for Chandru, I just love saying that because it's brown. Just got to shout that out. I can't get that out of my head when he does videos of fans like this. So this anyways, this one, I had some technical issues. I just was not uh, turning or wasn't even running. I don't know if it was wired, it was like miswired. Someone might have been in there before and I got this at Tosa Restore. This was another fan that I was asked if I wanted and I took to it and took the light kit off it. It's a brass armed light kit and took it off. Had the tulip shades with it. I made a switch cap and painted it may not been my best job at it just because I, I had to use what I had. It's gloss brown. The rest is oxidized. The motor and the canopies actually are. Normally these would be a gloss brown when they're new. I've seen these new in box. So, so anyways, yeah, the wiring, I could not get it to run as a three-speed, which these are normally supposed to run as. Some things that I'm not sure of, I'm a little stumped on. So I managed to get this working. It's got a three-channel pull chain in it. One of those double type uh, pull chains. But I got it running as a single speed check the capacitor I thought that was bad turned out to measure good so I tried a four so it definitely uh, runs a little fast but right now this runs on single speed as it's meant to be and I'm thinking of I I'd like to put this where the Sinlix is behind it that'd be my place to install this so here we go Here's, uh, let's see if there's inrush or no inrush. So zero to high, just like an industrial. Got kind of a little winding sound, a wind up sound. Point six. Five, nine. So it looks like a little inrush, not huge, not nothing drastic. So 0.58 is what it draws. 66.6, .6. yes, the evil. This is evil brown, oh, it's 66.7 watts. But let's see what the power, yeah, it's pretty much a power factor one. There's no current rating on here. I have another Moss Tropical Breeze that I, that's one of Dan's I took to compare when I was trying to work on this one. And um, I got it wired similar to that, but it's unfortunately, yeah, single speed. And one of the other things I looked at, I saw 85 watts on that one, but that's like a 52, I believe. This is a 48, so I think it's rated a little lower. It does have a little smaller motor, slightly, so I'm going to go with that. I'm going to go with this. This is not reasonably uh, slow. This is pretty fast. So before I do spin down, I'm going to measure, try the RPMs with this tachometer here. Thousand fifteen. Uh, it's kind of giving. I'm just gonna go with thousand ten. I got the calculator here. Ten ten. 
divided by four, 252.5 or 252 and a half RPMs, because you take your reading here from the tachometer and divide that by the number of blades. So I got, so that looks about right. Yep, that's a pretty good speed. It's flying. I'll give it that. And then got this anemometer right here. And I'm gonna try and measure, I'm gonna measure the uh, cubic feet a minute. See what we get for air. This thing is giving good air. It's definitely pretty strong. Kind of out at the edge, 511, 531. Yep, I'm getting 531 with this thing. Whoa. I'm trying to get up. I'm trying to get underneath. I would have liked to have done it out in the Bay Area, but uh, I had a lot of technical issues. I was servicing it on this test rig here. So, uh, 531 times 12.57. And that is, I get 6,074 cubic feet a minute out of this one. This ain't no 9,000 cubic feet a minute, but uh, that's what I get. This is more of your uh, residential spinner, but this is a good one. Just, just to be sure, make sure I did this right. Actually got 551 is this time times 12.57. This is 48. So yeah, six still in the high 6,000, almost 7,000, 6,926. See if I can show that. Yeah, so almost 7,000 cubic feet a minute is what I'm getting on this one. Well, time for spin down. Looks like it's getting a long spin down. Yeah, one of the reasons I want to change that Sinlix out behind it is, uh, yeah, a couple of the cane pieces fell out of the blades, so I'm going to have to glue those back in with uh, wood glue or so. So that'll be another project. Still got a long spin down. But if I put that over there, I got wall controls, by the way. So it's fine if it runs single speed because because I would have put this on a wall control anyways. But it's cool though. Hmm. 
Let's see how long. All right, it's time for the decade box. Let's see where this starts and what kind of control we can use this on. All right. One, two, three. Oh, I think that's gonna keep going. That's definitely going 0.14 amps. So that's pretty good. That's nice. Good to know. Four. Let's see what this does on four. Okay, let's try five. Typical current draw on five. Decent low right here. This is what most controls would give you for a low speed on this fan at five microfarads. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. So I could use this on a four seven eleven. Right now, 13. Let's see. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with high. There's definitely a difference. So I could use a five, eight, and thirteen. Or, or four, seven, eleven. Which I do have. I do have a 4711. Take it off high so I can see what it's. Here's 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, so I'm right at high with 20, let's just see, 22, here let's go back to 21, let's see. So I'm right at high with 21, but then if I go 22, nope, I'm still leveled with high. Three. Okay, I start to creep over and it comes right back. It's like right on that borderline there. How about 24? Let's see if that goes over. 25, 26, 30. Okay, it goes over very slowly. So at least it doesn't go way over. Yeah. 
try the variable, solid state variable speed control. See if, uh, if it's noisy or quiet. Okay, this is started off with living room quiet. Yeah, it's I would not not sure that this is bedroom quiet. I mean, if it's if it was put on solid state here, I wouldn't care as much. <coughs> All right, what to dry up pretty much. Okay, well that is actually all I have for this uh, brown moss tropical breeze. Cast iron view fan spinner motor, spinner fan. So keep watching and subscribing and I'll be back with some more fans. So keep on watching.